Staten Island Borough President James Otto visited fourth graders at PS45 for the 20th anniversary of the Readers Are Leaders, along with former Congressman Vito Pacella, who started the borough-wide program. Magician and children's author Mike Lane performed for the anniversary and issued a challenge to the fourth graders. Right here, not on TV. Watch carefully as I make the ketchup disappear. And it's gone! Let's hear it! All right, all right, all right. Wait a second. Wait a second. Did somebody say I was holding it? Yes! These guys are pretty smart. You know, a lot of people say, you didn't make it disappear. You're just holding it from the bottom. You know what I tell those people? If I were holding it, how would you explain this? My book's part of the program this year, and we're also going to have a contest. So the contest will be if you read my books and you write a book report, I'm going to read all the book reports, and my favorite one, first place, I'll come to that school, I'll do a magic show, and the winner will also get my four books, hardcover, signed by me, and we'll also have a second and third place prize as well. The students who first started it are about to turn 30. 100,000 Staten Island kids have gone through this program. I've read over 600,000 books. I'm told that comes out to 23 billion words. And as Congressman Fisella said, the title of this initiative says it all. Children who read do become leaders in whatever profession um, they pursue. And instilling in them and honing their love for books benefits them in so many different ways, academically certainly, um, but it gets, uh, it allows them to, to control their own destinies to, in, in some ways. It, if, if you want to read about sports, if you want to read about nature, if you want to read about science, you control the, dis the decision. And this is, a, this is a success story, and it's a uniquely Staten Island success story, and we're going to continue it, and my successors will continue it as well.